enough to grow up, we can stay forever young Living on my sofa, drinking rum and cola Underneath the rising sun I could give a thousand reasons why But you're going And you know that What's up everybody? It's your girl Lisa Risa And I'm back with another video Hey, another video But before we get into the video You already know what to do Hit that like and subscribe button, get this video more noticed because I know some people need to know these things. And yeah, so today's video is going to be about seven life hacks that every girl needs to know about the period. And I just need to put this out there. Everybody is going to have periods. Everybody do have periods. If you don't got them now, you're going to get them. It just depends on who you are. It just depends on the age. So everybody's not going to get that period at the same time. Stop rambling and get right into the video. Hey. Eh. 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 Number one. Um, to make your period um, lighter, you need to drink lots and lots and lots of water. I can't stress that enough because you need to drink lots of water. It makes the flow smoother and it makes your flow way easier. Like, you know, you know what I mean? It makes the flow easier and it makes the flow lighter. Who, who wants a heavy period? So with that being said, um, you can drink water with lemon. I know that's good for you too. I drink it. I drink that like twice a week. Um, I don't know if you could drink it more or I don't know. I just drink it twice a week. Number two, try to stay away from red meat. It makes your period heavier. So try to stay away from red meats in advance two weeks or one week before you come on your monthly cycle um, because it will make it lighter if you stay away from them but if you just don't care you just like stay i'm about to eat some um beef meat some hamburger you know try to stay away from them because it will make it heavier and i'm telling you you gonna have to change your pad like well i don't know how heavy you all is but me i have to change my pad like every 30 minutes when i eat a lot of red meat for my period so you wouldn't want to do that will you i, I think not you will not want to do that will you I think not. Number three, try and stay away from candy and sweets. And I say this because candy and sweets, you know, with the sugar, well, I don't know. Candy and sweets, it just like makes you have cramps, menstrual cramps, and cramps don't feel good. And you all know that. I know that. Try to stay away from that because it will make you crap and you gonna be in bed or then you're not gonna want to do nothing and none of that so yeah that's why i say no candy or no chocolate this happens to me a lot like in school or in a public place if you're in a public place and you got to change your pad you you don't want people in the bathroom to hear you i'm wrapping it this is what you do. You flush the toilet, okay? You flush the toilet, you hurry up and take it off. And then, you know, like, put the pad on. That's all you gotta do. If you want them to hear you. That's all you have to do. I guarantee you it'll work. It'll work, it'll work, it'll work. Well, I guarantee you it'll work. It'll work, it'll work, it'll work. I think this is number four. Or five, I lost track, but I'm just keep on saying it. Like, okay, how to wrap a pad when you want to score in a public place? This is what you do. It's two things. You can either wrap it in the pad paper that it came out of, or you can wrap it in toilet paper. So this is what you do. Say you take the pad off, right? You will wrap it like this and like do like that. But you know, of course, you gotta grab the sides like that, and then you do it like that. You see that? Then you simply take the pad paper, like that, and boom, wrap it, throw it right in the garbage, to the garbage next to you, and that'll be helpful. This is how you wrap a pad, you know, all wrapped up, then you throw it in the garbage next to you, easy, easy peasy, rice and cheese, right? Uh, okay. Think 
this is number six. This is number six. So we all know when we in school and you need to carry around a pad and you don't want everybody to see it. Like the boys to see it, the girls you're not friends with. You can always bring a little cute emergency bag. Yes, it's cute. You can carry it around. You can even put your pencils and stuff in it. It's like a cute emergency bag in it. And what I got in here is I have a pad. I have a tampon. For those who use tampons, some people prefer tampons, some people prefer pads. So what you prefer, what you put in here. And then you have you have um Tylenol for you in school or a public place and you cramping and you need some medicine right there this is a little cute travel bag you can put it in your book bag you can put it in your purse i mean it's small enough you can even carry it around with your books and stuff i'm ready let's go yes that's what you can do hey oh and the last thing that um, I use is um, a period checker app. A period checker app. Now my period checker app I use is called Flow. So this app is called Flow. You click it. Uh huh. Uh huh. Um. You click it and it like it tells you like. I click it, it tells you like when you're gonna come on, like for next month. This one's September, next month is October. Like for next month, it tell me I'll be on the 19th through the 25th. Um, it even tells you how many footsteps you took today. Well, I didn't update this, so you know, it only said I took 16 steps. And you can also click the plus button and you can like, and you can like map it out and then tell you how you feeling or you know all of that. So sex and drive, didn't have sex. How are you? I'm really happy. Log symptoms, everything is fine. Um, Other stress, nothing. And water, you know, I can say I drunk. You know, I didn't drink no water today, but so yeah, that's. So yeah, I didn't drink water today, so you know. So yeah, you click analyze the symptoms, and it'll tell you like, it'll tell you your health insights. You like mine. I have, you have logged your mood. It's good. This is the natural and the follicular phase of the cycle. There's a hormonal season. Why you feel more energetic and happy during the first half of your menstrual cycle. So basically, it just tell you how you feeling. And yeah, that's the app I use. So that's good. It track your period because you know I'm really irregular. So you know, that's the app I use. It track your period because I'm really irregular. Sometimes I can be irregular. Um, I might not know. I'm supposed to come on one day, but then I don't end up coming on it. So yeah, that's the app I use. So. If you guys like that video, you already know what to do. Hit that thumbs up button and subscribe button below. Um, make sure you follow my social medias in the description box below. And yeah, if you guys like this video, tell me more videos that you guys would like to see me do. And I will do them positively. Um, and yeah, until next time. Bye. Mwah.